While researching for your assignments or labs, you will come across different types of articles, including research and review articles. Both of these are scholarly sources, but it's important to be able to distinguish the two. Research articles are the result of experiments, observations, or measurements from the field or in the lab. Since they are first-hand accounts of scientific research, they will provide evidence to build your claims in your assignments or support your lab write-ups. Review articles, on the other hand, summarize results and ideas from many other sources, usually other research articles. They give useful context to a research area by identifying key concepts, research findings, articles, and authors. A research article will be structured like a lab report. It will usually have headings like materials and methods, data, analysis, discussion, as well as graphs or other images presenting data. A review article structure will not have standard headings from one article to another. A review article's graphics may summarize or explain concepts rather than present experimental data, or the graphic may be from another article. In general, though not always, review articles have longer reference lists since they are writing comprehensively about a topic. For example, this research article has 22 references, while the following review article has 308. So a research article may have, on average, 3 to 40 or so references, and a review article typically has many more than that, sometimes in the hundreds. Other indications of a review article are the journal title may contain the word review. However, be aware that some articles in these journals may not be review articles. The abstract may also indicate that the article is a review. There are other types of articles besides research and review articles. Ask your instructor or a librarian if you have questions about research material that you have found.